Hi guys, uh, in this video I would like to give you a quick tips for Mac users. If you are using a portable hard drive and would you like to use Time Machine and your own storage together, you, you will need to watch this video. First of all, connect your drive to the Mac and be sure it's connected. On the right corner, you will see the Find button and click there. Type Utility Disk or Disk Utility and you will find the Disk Utility. Open it and then be sure what we are working on. We are working on the Xtreme SSD and here is the Xtreme SSD. When you check there, some of them have partition, but on the Xtreme SSD, you will see that there is no partition icon. It does not give me the uh, make any partition. Also, when you try to erase, there is no shame button as well. What we will do, on the left, there is a wheel and click there, show all device we are clicking. And then on the extreme drive, you will see there is a scan this extreme drive, another uh, hat. And now, what will we do? Firstly, erase. I am retyping the name as extreme, extreme SST and uh, Mac OS journal it. But the shame, I am choosing the quit partition map. Now I'm raising the portable drive. It's trying to erase it and we will see. Decide later. And then now you will see, friends, uh, the partition button is available. Make it partition. For the time machine, I'll use 120 gigs. It's enough for me. Maybe you can choose something different. Uh, try to that one is journal, 120 gigs, and name change the name. I'll write down the time machine. Yes, time machine. Now apply it. Yes. It's giving yes partition divided to now we will see two parts. Okay, decide later. Yes, that's finished my friends. You will see on the right there is two parts and you can check one of them is 102 gigs and the other one is 800 something thank you very much my friends for watching if you like this thumbs up please thank you